Um, the problem that brought me here <laughs> to testify about is healing from, um, healing from allergies. Ever since I moved to the Tri-Cities seven years ago, every summer starting in late June, um, July was torment. I would have a severe allergic reaction to, not Tri-Cities, but to the air, <laughs> to the things growing, and I would just have itching everywhere like it would itch under the skin so if you're itching it doesn't help it would just itch my eyes if i would make the mistake of trying to scratch my eyes like i couldn't stop it was just so bad and um my nose was running like at night i had to have a paper towel next to my bed just to kind of stop on my, on my back and when i would wake up i couldn't just get up because it would just all come rushing out i mean i have to like literally um, just dump all that stuff into the paper. It was, it was just really bad. Everywhere I went, um, either to the bank or wherever to the store, um, just I had to watch myself because I can just start dripping at any time from my nose. It was just really annoying. It was horrible because I'm a truck driver and my eyes are itching. I could sneeze like nonstop and I, I have to watch the road. So it was really big inconvenience, big, I would say, torment. Now, you might think allergy is no big deal. A lot of people have allergies, especially in Tri-Cities. But if you, were not to, if you were to stop taking your medication, you would see that it's torment. It's really, really bad. And I have prayed. So, I have a, so how long did you have these allergies? Seven years. Seven years. And so through those seven years, how did it affect your daily life? I remember you were telling me that you would go to places with... Tissue, toilet pe paper up your nose. Is that true? That is correct. The one, one relief was that I figured out that I, if I stuff my nose with uh, some kind of a tissue and just breathe through my mouth, then the itching goes away. This was like a temporary solution. And, and it would, I would, my nose wouldn't be dripping like all over. And where I work is outside uh, city limits where all the brush grows and everything. So it would be really bad. And uh, it would just, at work... Um, I have to take a sample of milk and one of the things that I have to do is I have to smell it. I have to, if it smells bad or if the odor is off, I cannot pick up that milk. And I could not smell anything because my nose was completely busy with doing something else. So it was just really, it was really a hard, it was really, um, it was horrible and I couldn't wait for the month of August because I knew it was going to be over because that's, that's about the time where it ends. And so, um, I prayed every day and I was really like praying about it really hard and I was actually disappointed that it was not going away. So s seven years, um, I don't know what's going on, but this year I prayed with anointing water and then I just, I just said, Jesus, the only way this thing is going to go away if you remove it. There's nothing I can do. There's nothing that doctors can do. Medication can only kind of, kind of make it easier, make it more bearable. But the only way it's going to go away if you remove it. And if it ever goes away, it's because you did it. And so just kind of, you know, if I have to go through three more years, five more years, I know you will do it. So just kind of uh, changed my approach and just completely relaxed. Uh, we, we know that uh, healing is just like breathing. You just got to trust God and it's not something that you have to force. You can't force yourself to be healed. And so when I took that approach by God's grace, um, the month of July came, June was ending and nothing. And so towards the end of July, which is right around now, I actually had a thought that, you know, maybe it's just the plants are not growing or the crops have been rotated. So you're not being affected by the plant that you used to be affected by. So you really didn't get healed, it's just a coincidence. And the minute I thought that, for about three days it came back really hard. Wow. And I'm like, no, 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 it was a healing. I, this is not just a coincidence. So it went away, it's, it's gone now, and I'm, I have, I've not taken any medication. I can breathe, no runny nose, no itchy eyes, no torment at night. So um, just really God has, has healed me, and I'm really grateful. Thank you, Jesus. Amen, amen. Let's put our hands together. Thank you, Alex, for the wonderful testimony.